Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the Curse of Monkey Island for more point-and-click adventure game action. We are right back where we left off in the theatre. Uh, we were trying to figure out that little light puzzle upstairs, but um, you guys have chipped in with a couple more comments, which I think are going to help us out with that. So, we're going to head outside to do that. Um, but first, if you haven't already done so, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell down below the video so you get a notification to your device every time I upload. And as always, guys, thank you all for your ongoing support. Right, so, one of the things I've been told uh, by Darkwing Arama is that apparently to fix that little boat on the beach, we need to potentially use a natural resource from the island, um, which got me thinking. Natural resources on the island, I'd probably say are sand. I guess that could be a natural resource. Um, water, that's again not going to help us. And then I thought maybe you know, some wood or some rubber. So I'm thinking maybe we've got to use one of those things to patch up the boat. Um, I think we we came over here, didn't we? And there was some wood over here, wasn't there? Yes, these rubber trees. And also Rethgall said that I need to pay more attention to these signs because apparently they actually give us massive hints and I've not been paying attention to those, so sorry guys. So. Patron rubber tree. Donated to Puerto Poyo by our Sumatran sister city of Vacaville. This tree is the only one of its kind in the entire Western Hemisphere. And stands as an everlasting symbol of the friendship between our two cities. That's right. Okay, so I don't know if it is anything to do with these, but any time I see them, I'm going to read them now. Tree. One of the many rubber trees common throughout the Caribbean, used as raw material for shipbuilding. Shipbuilding. <laughs> oh, I am so stupid. How am I so stupid? I don't know how I managed to wing my way through these games. Um, right, do we chop it down then or something? This knife might cut through regular wood, but not a rubber tree. Oh, okay. Can we do it on this, perhaps? This serrated knife won't work here. Okay, so we can't use the knife. What can we use then? The scissors? I wonder if the scissors will work. I don't want to cut that. Alright, we'll cut the tree then. <laughs> Another rubber tree. Well, the tree's too rubbery to cut with scissors. Right, it's too rubbery to cut with scissors. Yeah, of course. Um, can we? No, not. I was going to use the pin, but I don't think that's going to work. I don't want to pin that. No. Um, oh, I wonder if we can use the biscuit cutter. Apparently, we can. <laughs> I mean, I don't know if that's going to be what we need, but yeah, a rubber plug. <laughs> Right, okay. Um, I should read the signs more, you're right. Thank you, Darkwing Arama and Rethgall, for your comments. I really need to pay more attention to what's going on around me, don't I? So, you've prevented me from looking like a massive idiot, so thank you. So, let us go then down to that little beach. And we'll take a look around down there and see what is going on on the beach with the boat. Um, was it this way? I think we can double click, can't we? Yeah, so let's get to Danger Cove. Get down there. If Guybrush ever wants to get there, thank you. Okay. Danger Cove, we are now at. So what, do we just use the rubber plug with the boat then, I'm guessing? I mean, I guess that's what we do. So, I mean, it makes sense, I guess. We like plug the hole and then we can you know then we've got like a, a watertight boat so oh and then i wonder if we take that boat over to the big boat that could be it right yes wow, for a homemade rubber plug that worked very nicely it won't stay in there oh no it won't stay in okay what if we try using the paste that we picked up earlier because that might actually have some sort of use now right the plug is all pasty now there we go. Looks like some sort of like cereal or something, I don't know. Perfect. Right, I think that's worked. There we go. It's in there now. Can we use the boat? Let's try looking at it to see if it's seaworthy Looks first. To me. It is watertight. Let's use it. Hopefully we don't drown or get eaten by these sharks we can see. Hey! This is kind of like on Monkey Island... Um, one, isn't it, when we went around, well, Monkey Island on the little boat. 
let's go to the pirate ship. I love the little overhead pirate, well, a pirate ship, the little overhead sort of boat views are quite cool. Okay, on to the pirate ship we go. Didn't we need chicken or something for this? Oh crap, look at these sharks. Uh, there's a window here, is that just like banana like skin? Light is on in the captain's cabin. Can we shout? I don't want anyone to know I'm here. Oh okay, so we're doing this discreetly then. Looks like a lot of banana skins scattered around here, doesn't it? Uh, oh, there we go, we're up. Alright, what do we have here? Fifteen men on a dead man's hunt. Who are you? Uh oh. Uh, I am Guybrush Threepwood and I'm a mighty pirate. I want my girlfriend. I mean to kill you all. Uh, Ensign Guybrush Threepwood reporting for duty, sir. Let's do that, we're going undercover. And Guybrush Streetwood reporting for duty, sir. Huh? Hmm. You don't look like a member I'm of the new. Crew. Honest, I'm the new guy. I knew he was going to say that. I heard of any new recruits. I'll have to check that out with my captain. Okay, bye. Yes, Streetwood. You come aboard the sea cucumber. The sea cucumber. Ah, Mr. Falsy. I'm the first mate. And my captain. Ah, uh, yeah. Why, he's the scourge of the seven seas. Who's that? Red pirate, Le oh no, not LeChuck. Yes, Captain. It's on the table, sir. LeChuck. That's right. Captain Lech. LeChuck. Yes, Captain. Just not LeChuck. Not LeChuck, please. He says you to be tortured. Choose your punishment. Uh -oh. You can um. either be tarred and feathered, or you can walk the plank. Um. I walked that plank thing on the way up. Good enough. Can't you just let me off with a stone warning? Feathered sounds good. How about just feathered? <laughs> Any torture is not involving pain, humiliation, or stickiness. Uh, let's try blagging our way out. Oh, I walked that plank thing on the way up. Good enough? No. So, oh. well, I suppose we'll have to go with walking I don't want to walk the plank. We'll avoid using the tar and feathers. It's okay. messy, and we need to save the tar for emergency leak repair. Oh, I see. What the what hell? Say, Can we make him walk the plank? It's a crew of monkeys. <laughs> Any last words, Threepwood? Um, I'll be back to kill you all. I'll be back to kill you all. All right, in you go. No, I don't want to go in. Oh crap. That's odd. There was no splash. Splash! <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Right. I'm guessing we have to go back up again. Right, we're up. He's gonna come out again, isn't he? Ah, he's not. Okay. What do we have around here then? There's the door. There's the hold. Can we take a look at this? How strange. The hold is full of broken luggage. Broken luggage. Can we open it? Mm, no. Can we do something with this bucket of tar? It's a big old sloppy bucket of tar. <laughs> Who's there? Oh no, not again. You again? Yes, yeah, me again. Why you came back on board, but you'll be sorry you did. Oh, I've got to walk the plank again. <laughs> All right. In you go! Oh. Stop walking the plank. Okay. It's that plank I keep falling off. Can we do something to I'll it? I'll never be able to pick that up. Nah. What do we reckon? Can we like break it or something? What if we use the arm on it? I don't want to do that. Can we do it from here, maybe? I don't know, I don't even know if this is a... Hang on. Uh, can we go this way, actually? Is there... No, it's not. Right, I wonder if we have to do something to the plank. It's that plank I keep falling off. Right, okay. Um, can we cut it or something? The plank is too thick to cut through its system. Right, I bet we have to saw it, don't we? With this thing again. Yep, we do. <laughs> yes, we're on a roll, guys. We're on a roll. Oh, do we pick up the plank now, then? 
Right, let's pick up the floating plank when these sharks go away. Plank. Oh. It's the remnants of the ship's plank. Can we maybe do something to it then? Oh, maybe we use this. I can't use the skeleton arm with that. Okay. Can we Oh, maybe we can go up now because there's no plank for us to walk. Uh, right. So, so can we just open the door? Should we try going in? Who's there? It's me again. I'm back. <laughs> again with the sneaking on board the ship. That's what I do. I'm a meddler. <laughs> Ah, I see, yeah, there's no plank now. Someone's vandalized the plank, look at that. Oh, no, not tar and feathers. Oh, no, not the tar and feathers. I don't want to be tarred and feathered. Oh, man, we're actually being tarred and feathered as well, look. We're like a shadow now. What the hell? Now what? So what do I do now? Yeah, exactly. I don't know. We've never done this before. Aren't you humiliated? Not really. Yes, so, but no more than you. Well, and just get lost then. Uh, okay. I mean, we can't really walk the plank as such. I mean, we look pretty stupid. Looks watertight to me. Do we just walk around like this now? Okay, what the hell do we do at this point? We're dressed like some sort of feather man. I don't know. That's um, I don't know how that's gonna help anything really. How is that going to help anything? Let's, um, let's go to the voodoo lady. El Pollo Diablo! At last, hmm? one of my demonic brethren come to set me free! Oh, brother. Oh, he now, thinks we're the chicken thing! So that I might run free alongside you as we terrorize the mortals of this island. I see. He thinks we're the chicken thing. Wait! Don't leave! Shut up, Murray. Oh, so he thinks we're the giant chicken man. Oh, does that mean we can talk to the chickens now? Can we, like... I've got nothing to say. Oh, no, we can't. Oh, look, a sign. Untitled composition in gold and diamond. <laughs> this newest addition to our public works of art was shamefully taken without authorization. Yeah, she's on the boat, isn't she, in the... In danger coat. Right, so I wonder now. Can we like do anything to these chickens? Now that we're a chicken. Mm, no. No, apparently not. I've got nothing to say. Okay. Um There was something about the giant chicken, wasn't there? Where did we see about that? About the giant chicken demon thing. It was in town, wasn't it? Was it in the chicken restaurant? Was it in here? It was around here somewhere. There was the, like the portrait of it, and we asked someone about it, didn't we? Wonder if it was in here actually. Let's go in and see. If not, maybe it was in the theatre. Yeah, there it is on the wall. Madre de Dios, es el pollo diablo. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, okay. Huh? Yes, I've released your prisoners, and now I've come for you. And then, yeah, I don't, you know. Let's say this. Si, he deado en libertad los prisioneros y ahora vengo por ti. Well, you're not taking me without a fight. Oh, we've got a fight in there. Oh, crap. Oh! This chicken grease washed off all the feathers. Whoops. Oh, I see. Absolutely, Captain. I'll get right on Wait, the captain's a giant monkey? What's that, Captain? I eat too so much it's not LeChuck. Well, I, I just got a weakness for chicken, that's all. I know you don't have any weaknesses, Captain LeChimp. Captain LeChimp. Oh, my word. <laughs> oh, 
the chimp. Oh, the chimp. I thought it was the chuck. Well, if the captain is an ape, then Mr. Fossey must be. Aye, aye, captain. Fresh bananas for the whole crew. An utter loon. Yeah. What's that, captain? <laughs> Your parasites are bothering you. Well, of course I'll groom you, sir. Right, so I see. They no, wanted sir. the chicken, Finding didn't they, for dinner? Maybe just the boost our right, crew makes needs. sense now. What? With the riches we get from this, we can get new and better ships and become the terror of the Caribbean. All right, yeah, this guy's like kind of crazy. Um, okay, what's out here? There's a porthole here. Can we open it? Yeah, so I wonder if we can go out that way. Um, but let's... Can we pick up some fruit? I'm not in the mood for fruit. There's a vase. Ah, oh, there's a treasure map. Corn on the cob, cranberries, mashed potatoes, biscuits. Oh, can we do something with the biscuit we've already got, maybe? Yeah, I don't think he'd like that. What's this? A pitcher? Ah, I hate porcelain. It's a long story. <laughs> I'll explain later. Okay. Um, what else do we have? Something went red here, but I don't know if it's just. Right, it's a tire swing. It's a tire swing. Mm, no. There's some bananas. It's a bowl of bananas. Le chimp. Can we talk to the chimp? I think Mr. Fossey is the only guy who can talk to him. If he knows I'm here, he might do something even more horrible to me. Oh, okay. So we've got to go out the window, I think. Oh crap! I forgot about the boat. Uh, what is this? Oh, is that the plank? So what? Okay, I'm confused now. So what the hell do we do in there? Wait, hang on. Oh, we can get in the window now, I see. Is there... Okay, maybe there's a way we can... Can we get up here, make some noise, and then run to the window or something? Is that a possibility? I don't know. It's a big old sloppy bucket of tar. I've had enough tar, thank you. Is there anything we can do out here? Is there anyone nah. in the hold? No. They'd torture me for sure if I went in now. Okay, so what the hell can I do? Uh, can we, like, break the door or something? We've got some... Oh, we've got chicken grease now. Where the hell, what the hell do we do with chicken grease? Chicken grease won't do any good with that. I didn't realise we picked some chicken grease up. It's all over everything. What the hell do we do with chicken grease? Hmm. The mystery deepens. Can we maybe use the chicken grease in here somewhere? I don't think he'd like that. I don't think he'd like that. I don't think so. Chicken grease won't do any good with that. Chicken grease won't How do are we going to get that. this map over here? They'd see me. Right, can we lob something at it? Or... Hmm, okay. What do we do? Oh, can we use the ventriloquism book? It's an interesting read on its own, but I should try it out on somebody. Ah. Right, I see. <laughs> uh, testing, testing. Check one, Make him think two, we're outside. Uh, uh, three. Uh-oh, I'm hearing the voices again. Oh, we use it with the chimp, I see. So it sounds like Mr. he's actually Fossey, talking. I've been thinking. Are you all right, Captain? You sound different. Don't interrupt. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, sir. Maybe it's time we gave up pirating. I mean, take a look around at me and the rest of the crew. We're all monkeys. <laughs> you mean in the Darwinian sense, sir? No, I mean in the quite literal sense. Uh, have you noticed that the crew is happier swinging from the masts than swabbing the decks? I don't even want to mention what they've been flinging around the ship. Oh, nice. Are you suggesting that I'm not disciplining the crew enough? No, no, I'm suggesting that we all give up this charade and go back to the trees. That's the life for a monkey, not sailing the seas for months on end. 
This is just ridiculous. Strongly about it, sir. I suppose I can't argue. I think our last order of business should be to dig up that statue and it'll be tough on the men, sir. But I'll tell them that you think it best. Okay, but first we should dig up that statue and give it to I'll make sure they understand that it's not. Yeah, the statue though, man, the statue. And then we can dig up that statue and Okay, never mind then. Okay, right, so he's gone. So now we can maybe pick up a whole bunch of crap in here. That must be the map to where they've buried Elaine. Ah. Well, with all eyes open, follow the path to the X. Southeast, northwest, what? what? Okay, I'm guessing we can re- Oh, tickets. I don't go in for all that highbrow, artsy theater stuff. Besides, if I want to enter the theater, I can always use the stage door. Oh, okay. Um, can we pick up any of this stuff? I think I'll leave that here. I can't imagine any need for a loaf of plunder, but I don't want another biscuit. Well, let's just try and pick all this up, pick just up, in case. In my pants. I'm not that interested in mashed potatoes right now. Bananas. I'm not in the mood for bananas. Cranberries. I never liked cranberries. Salt and pepper. And I, don't plan to I avoid salt whenever possible, and corn only on the cob. Fresh... No, the corn is all buttery and greasy. Bananas over here. I'm not in the mood for bananas. Okay. Can we talk to the chimp? I think Mr. Fossey is the only guy who can talk to him. Oh, okay, apparently not. So I wonder what we use the chicken grease for then? Because it's nothing to do with here. Um, can we use this boat to go back to shore? Right, let's get back to shore and then we'll take a look at this map to see where they've buried Elaine. Okay, let's have a look. With all eyes open, follow the path to the X. Southeast, northwest, west, south, east. Two paces northeast, east, southwest, X marks the spot. What on earth is that? I have no idea what that means. Um, Jeez. Not a clue. Does it sort of mean something here? On the on the map? Like, there's not... There's not really anything... I mean, that could be southeast. That could be south, southwest, northwest. There's nothing at north. Is there anything at north on. Hang on. Is there anything at north on the thing? No, there is. Uh, there's nothing at northeast, though, either. I have no idea. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, can we go through here, by the way? Use this little shortcut. So, I don't know. We've made progress, but we've still got to figure out this puzzle in here. With the the light show thing. And we need instructions to be able to do that. But I haven't found any instructions as of yet. Um, so, I'm not sure what we're going to do with that, to be honest. Hmm. I wonder if we could... I'm just going to try something here, just purely because there's all bananas here. Um, I wonder if we could potentially use this. Let me just try it. Southeast, northwest. So, south. So, northwest, north, northeast, east. That could be like a. Hang on. No. Oh, wait. Hang on. Northwest. Yes! It's working! He's not doing the little error message now. So, west, south, east. Yeah, so I think it relates to this. It's going to be buried there, isn't it? East. Right, so west, south, east. To northeast. East, south, west. What the hell is that? Oh, that's from Sam and Max, isn't it? <laughs> right. Two northeast. East, south, west. South, west. That's it. That must be where Elaine is buried. Really? They've buried Elaine right in the theatre? That is a bizarre now, place. The I know you <laughs> All the monkeys are here. How about some 
amazing juggling. <laughs> Oh, okay. Um, well, I guess we'll leave it there then. Who knows what we have to do next? I'm, I mean, I completely fluked that one. Luckily, I did try that, actually, because um, I probably would have forgotten about that between episodes. But, yeah, so I think the next one we'll have to go and somehow dig up that little X on the stage. Why would they bury Elaine on a stage? That's really weird. Um, but, yeah, so we've made good progress. Thank you for your comments, guys. You really helped me out in this one, actually, because I would have been wandering around trying to figure out how to repair the boat, but we've done it. Um, so hopefully we're going to get Elaine back shortly, but something tells me we probably won't. So, as always guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new, or just haven't already done so. And I will see you all next time.